Have you ever wondered why Australia is the only place with road trains? For those unfamiliar with the term, road trains are a marvel of transportation engineering, essentially a prime mover pulling multiple trailers, similar to a freight train, but on the road. These mechanical beasts are designed to carry vast amounts of goods across the sprawling expanses of the Australian continent. Now you might be thinking, why aren't these road behemoths utilized elsewhere? Well, Australia boasts unique conditions that make road trains not just feasible but essential. While the concept of road trains may seem like a novelty to many, in Australia, they are an integral part of the transportation ecosystem, moving goods across thousands of miles of rugged terrain and linking remote communities to the rest of the country. So buckle up because we're about to embark on an exciting ride. Consider this your ticket to a journey into the fascinating world of Australian road trains. The story of road trains in Australia is a tale of innovation born out of necessity. Our journey begins in the 1930s when the vast and expansive Australian outback presented a unique transportation challenge. The distances between towns were immense, the roads were harsh, and the environment was unforgiving. The solution, a marvel of engineering known as the road train. The road train was introduced as a more efficient way to transport goods across the vast Australian landscape. These colossal vehicles, capable of hauling multiple trailers at once, enabled the transportation of goods in large quantities, reducing costs, and increasing the efficiency of trade routes. But the road train's usefulness wasn't limited to peacetime activities. When the Second World War broke out, these mighty machines played a vital role. They were used to transport military supplies, equipment, and troops across the vast Australian continent. With the war escalating, the road train proved its worth as a reliable and efficient means of transportation, even in the harshest of conditions. After the war, the road train continued to evolve, adapting to the changing needs of the country. The 1950s saw the introduction of the triple road train, an innovation that allowed even more goods to be transported at once. As Australia's economy grew, so too did the size and capacity of the road trains. Today, these massive machines can haul up to four trailers and carry a staggering 200 tons of cargo. The story of the road train is a testament to Australia's spirit of innovation and resilience. From their humble beginnings in the 1930s to their integral role in the Second World War and their evolution into the colossus of the road that they are today, road trains have become an iconic symbol of Australia's rugged and vast landscape. So the history of the road trains is as vast and diverse as the Australian landscape itself. Now you might be asking yourself, why are road trains only found in Australia? Well, that's a great question. And the answer lies within Australia's unique geographical layout and logistical challenges. Australia is a vast country, the sixth largest in the world to be exact. It's about the same size as the continental United States, but with a population smaller than Texas. This immense size combined with a sparse population creates a unique transportation challenge. The remote areas of Australia known as the Outback are hundreds of miles from the nearest town or city. Transporting goods over such long distances without road trains would be inefficient and costly. This is where the road trains come in. Their length and hauling capacity make them perfect for transporting large quantities of goods across the vast Australian landscape. They're like a freight train on the road, carrying everything from livestock and fuel to groceries and mining equipment. These massive vehicles can traverse the long, straight and often empty roads of Australia with ease making them a practical solution for the country's transportation needs. Another element that makes Australia perfect for road trains is its robust mining industry. Mining is a significant part of the Australian economy and it's often carried out in remote parts of the country where regular trucks just can't handle the heavy loads. Road trains, however, with their multiple trailers and powerful engines, can transport these heavy loads efficiently and safely. Lastly, let's not forget that Australia has a long-standing love affair with big things, Australians are known for their fondness of larger-than-life attractions, from the big banana in Coffs Harbour to the giant koala in Victoria. So it's no surprise that they're also home to the world's largest trucks. To sum it all up, Australia's unique geography, sparse population, and the need for efficient transportation of goods across long distances have made it the ideal place for road trains. They're a testament to the country's ingenuity in overcoming its geographical challenges. Australia's unique geography and logistical demands have made it the perfect home for these gigantic vehicles. 
The road trains have left an indelible mark on Australia's transportation landscape. These colossal machines have played a crucial role in shaping the country's economy, particularly in regions where the terrain is as vast as it is rugged. In the realm of mining, road trains have been indispensable. They transport massive amounts of ore across hundreds of miles, facilitating the extraction of valuable resources. Similarly, in agriculture, these vehicles have streamlined the process of moving produce from remote farms to bustling markets. The transportation sector itself has also experienced a significant boost. Road trains have created jobs, fostered skill development, and encouraged innovation in vehicle technology. But the impact goes beyond the economic. Road trains have also brought about a sense of connection, bridging the gap between isolated communities and bustling urban centers. They've made it possible for goods, services, and even people to move across the expanse of the Australian outback. The road trains in many ways are the lifeblood of Australia's remote and rural communities. So there you have it, the fascinating story of Australia's road trains. We've delved into the captivating world of these mammoth vehicles, tracing their history back to their inception in the land down under. We've explored the reasons that make Australia the unique home of road trains, from the vast open landscapes to the stringent regulations and the innovative Aussie spirit. We've also touched on the significant impacts road trains have on Australia's economy and infrastructure, highlighting their role in connecting remote areas, delivering essential goods, and supporting key industries. They're not just vehicles, they are the lifeline of a continent. These massive vehicles are a testament to Australia's grit, determination, and ingenuity. They are a reflection of the country's ability to adapt and innovate in the face of challenges. And that, my friends, is what makes them so special. Next time you see a road train, remember it's not just a vehicle, it's a symbol of Australia's enduring spirit of innovation and resilience.